Hey what's up guys this is the Tech Boost channel and this video is a review of HTC Sense 6 update on the HTC One M7. I updated the HTC One to Sense 6 a couple of weeks ago, it was running KitKat 4.4 with Sense 5 and now I'm covering the changes in the OS. Starting with the user interface, the look of Sense 6 is overall more flat and clean. In the lock screen, the clock weather widget is now located on the top and the unlocking gesture is changed from dragging the clock or the lock anywhere up to three options from the lock icon. Go to blink feed to the right, home screen to the left, and up to unlock to wherever you were before. The launcher also got a facelift, the new dock is transparent now and the page indicator is changed from a bar to dots. As for blink feed, it is flat, colorful and supports smooth and continuous scrolling. The app drawer has been cleaned up a bit by removing the clock weather widget from the top and also getting rid of the dock. One of the best features that Sense 6 brought with it is themes which are stock themes in settings submenu personalization and they change the color template of the system and stock apps. Another new feature is font style under display, gestures and buttons, as you can see I'm using Helvetica. And just to point out, the wallpapers, ringtones and alarm tones have been replaced with new ones. I'm going to show you some of the stock HTC apps that are updated. Starting with the camera app, the design is new and it's the same one on the M8, though the camera app stocks with the same features of Sense 5. The clock app is now flat and clean looking and it has some new alarm tones as I already mentioned. The music app has the same layout and functionality of the old one but has the new flat looks. The calculator is as simple as ever and it is somewhat cleaner than before. The settings app has some new icons but keeps the same layout and pretty much the same options as in Sense 5. Overall, Sense 6 is more elegant, clean and flat. It brought mainly visible changes but only a few new features and all those changes are good and enhance the user experience but I personally miss the old wallpapers and tones. 